game at the 7-Eleven. I'll be like, go Mark. But here we go, first to two right now. Kokoma, Kokoma as well is not sponsored, just traveling again, like I said, on his own dime. Breadman, obviously talented enough to make it in the most stacked tournament here in top yep. four. Yep. I would love to see more of him around the world, around the globe. Oh yeah, prove it's not a fluke. Show us that you can compete everywhere. Uh, I'm yeah, looking at the tech and Twitter right now, posting fake news. I have no jet lag, I'm just tired. <laughs> Round one. I didn't sleep last night. Fight. Anyways, here we go. Back into the action. Opening up with a nice down two, and we were talking about, you know, a mark of an amazing Claudio player is the ability to land those low attacks. Very interesting, too. Kokuma going with Dragon. He got here. His last match, he chose Paul. Destroy Take with the Paul pick, but going back to his, I guess, main, if you want to call it, Dragon. Duh! So it's a little low crush right there. Both plays in rage. Doesn't even get a chance to use it. The one, two, and then the, the low right two. there. Round one, Breadman. Goes for the vampire knee, and then finally someone ducks the Wonder Woman. Yeah, Breadman sidestep. Nice Fine. combo, drops yeah, the drops last him. hit. Two shine again, there we go. That's what he went for before, the sidestep. Uh, Hopkin got interrupted, but not this time. Starburst, oh, fidget spinner, let's it. go. Good stuff here, and Breadman. 2-0? Oh, gets Kokomo? Breadman getting buttered up right now. Kokomo, definitely a face you're going to see in Amsterdam at the end of the year. That's crazy, because so we all know, okay, see, he's a Claudio specialist, but seeing him play against some of the top characters, playing against Dragonov, he already beat Nobi. We saw that. He's beaten almost pretty much every single Dragonov he's played against. The anti Dragonov specialist right now. Going for a follow up here. Spot. Back three. Ah, oh, he bet it. He was ready. He yeah, was ready. He bet it. Yep. That. Might have been it, but Kokomo's ready with the block in the second hit and the shoulder punish. Yeah. Gets around. Maybe a bit too eager from Breadman here. A bit too eager to end it right there. Good tech. It's scary. It's a first to two. Yeah, you want to just pull out all the stops right away. That's the problem is you can't always pull out. Sometimes you got to go in. I never pull out. Gets the float. Follow up here. Four three into the running punch. Superman. Got the Starburst, just running at him, tags him with the low. Oh, yeah. Brought Kokomo all the way to the wall. Another one. Yo, what is this? Superman in a Superman in Superman. That is a high. Doesn't pull the trigger on the second hit. Oh, man, he got him in the aerial state, so unable to get the float there on the hop kick. Plus frames on the hammer. Kokomo fighting his way back this round. Watch out. Don't get launched. Ah, again. That's it. No, he didn't get the float. Tagged him anyway. Breadman, what is going on with this guy? You win. For sale, is that this is one insane. He needs one more, and Kokomo's out. All right, again, thank you, everybody, for tuning in. I know it's either early where you're at. I know everyone in Europe, it's bright early in the morning. Uh, it's very late over in the East Coast and, uh, and the West Coast. So thanks for watching and tuning in. We are on the cusp of finding out who's going to be our champion here at the Tekken World Tour Korean Master Event. Let me give a shout-out to all the people in Asia that it's normal time. It's, yeah, uh, we're it's normal 5 here. It's 5.30. You guys, you watch an English stream around Asia, I guess you're my boys. Shout out to you guys as well. Yeah. We're winding down only one, two, three more matches to go. But I go. I don't I know. Even if you're tired, I don't, I'm not. I want to watch. I want to bracket reset. I want as much Tekken as possible. Yeah, I today. want to see it all. I mean, especially with the four players that we have left, I want to see as much of this amazing action that we can. And it's only going to make the storyline for the Tekken World Tour even better. Look at Kokuma thinking, though. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. So we have we have three mainstays on the second World Tour. We have Naroma, JD, Star, Kokoma, and the new guy, the local player, Breadman. Hopefully he'll be able to make it to more events, especially if he's getting this many points. This is what you want to see at every event. There's always, at least in Asia, there's always a surprise. There's always someone nice showing up. We had, a, not a surprise, but Tanakana doing work in Hong Kong. We had Lohai winning his first event with the law pick yeah. out in, uh, in Thailand. We had Love Neat from India. Blowing people up, demolishing Kudans. I love all these people coming out. Shout out to Tekken World Tour. Yeah. So let's see. Of course, see. lots of love to Bandai Namco Entertainment and Twitch for the Tekken World Tour and our sponsors, Quanba. I want to give uh, some extra shout outs to the production team over here. We got Cameraman, we have Farp, we have Jello. A lot of people from around the community helping contribute to the Tekken World Tour and put on this amazing production. Of course, you, Giuna, I know you're all over the place. You travel a lot for, uh, for Tekken and for other games as well. Hopefully it stays that way. Yeah, so. <laughs> hopefully we're not cut after this. This isn't the last season. But anyways, into the matchup again. 
And, you know, Breadman, he's been continuing uh, this amazing display how to fight against Dragunov. Kokoma looking looking confident in the matchup, sticking with the yeah, character Yeah, I was here. about to say, yeah, very interesting for him after the long uh, kind of thinking session, decided to um, stick with Dragunov. He's not oh, going to yeah. have a chance to change. He's only first to two. He's got to do it. He's got to win two in a row right now with Dragunov. Otherwise, he's out. Out at four. Oh, and there's the hot kick at the wall, able to convert not after enough, getting no. the starburst. And then, okay. yeah, there's the gas right there. Mid or low, goes mid. Round two. Yeah, I Fight. feel like uh, Bremen might have been able to do a more damaging combo at the wall, but he wasn't ready. Kept Kokomo alive and then ended up paying for it. Slicing Sobot up for three. Catches him. Kokomo looking a lot better so far in game two. But there are those lows that Markman's talking about, the Claudio lows. Not the best in the game. Yeah, but it's the best if you land them all. You got to be one of those players because it opens up a whole new world. Oh Picks my God! Up, goes he bet it again. Two zero. All right, Kokoma, very wise decision to stick with Dragonov. Fight. We might see it though. Who knows? If Kokoma can win this game, Redman did bring out Geese. He brought oh, out the Geese right. last I forgot time. about that. He has a number of characters. So Wonder we'll Woman see. ducks. Not the best punish, though. Yeah, I love the, co the adjustments, though. Kokoma has been making some amazing adjustments here in the matchup so far, relying more now on defense. Uh-oh, trying to catch him sidestepping there, forcing Breadman to actually start Beautiful. doing the movement. He went for the hop kick there. You heard it. Opening frames. Duh. Nice. Again, standing three. All right, this is dangerous now. Both players in rage. We're going to hear the gate drop, maybe? There oh, it is. There it a mix-up throw. No tech. Not dead? Oh, he Hit had him back turned. The way he woke up after that, that was a guaranteed attempt. Yeah, right in the ass. Yeah. All right, so Bremen gets on the board in game two. He's in the tracking moves, trying to seal that side set, but no dice. He saw the Hopkins come out, but gets floated instead. Not a lot of damage, but good position to give for Kokomo. Yeah, he's going to push towards the wall. Not going to get the full wall combo that he wants, but he does have the positioning, which is most important, especially when using Dragon Up. You want to limit their movement options. Oh, oh crushed that low. Get went that for, knife out of here. Yeah, he went for the Razor, tried to swipe away at his ankles. Man, Breadman is working. Yeah, he man. was down 2 0. Making his comeback. With the slip. Oh, okay, oh, never mind. Second. That might be dead. That should be dead. Rage. Yeah, drive, stomp. Dragon just off. like that, just like that, Kokomo it, ties it up. So what Again, do you think? What do you think? You're hundred. You're three. literally hundred percent. You have to fail once. Uh oh, wait! I saw the character select. Do okay, you, good. So we have think, some time to think, think about. You think he's it. doing a uh, geese, or do you think he's just taking a breather? All right. So this, this is might mess up my question. This, this might mess up my streak. So this is the million dollar question. This Who is the last one. Yes. All right. This I, is the last I'm one. I'm gonna I'm gonna ask the crowd. Phone a friend. I'm gonna I'm gonna phone a friend. Is it geese? He's gonna he's gonna stick he's gonna stick Claudio. There. All right. You're right. Claudio, everything. Kokomo, yep. of course, locked in with the dragon off. He just wanted the breather. Yeah, he just wanted the breather. Maybe Simply change colors off. on the outfit. He did it. He stuck with the the white. All white. Yeah. I'll go, white. I'll go to the bonus round. I'll even tell you who's going to win the matchup. Oh, my God. Don't. I'll tell you who's going to win this matchup. Don't. Just yeah. don't do it. Don't do it. Because the commentator curse. Okay. It might come back. Uh, no, might... no, no. It's not going to be cursed. Because it's going to happen exactly as I say it. Kokomo is going to go up 2-0 on rounds. Okay. And the bread man's going to come back and win it. If, if this happens... Then you know it's pre-recorded. Yeah, yeah. If and we're not really here in if Korea. This we're actually, actually happens. Then. We're actually back in Japan right now. You're in a lot of trouble if this actually happens. Yeah, we will get in a lot of trouble, but I will risk it and I will take it. Let's go into the matchup. Thanks for the Red Bull again. One. It has here definitely we go. given. Oh me my God, we got the home court advantage right now for Claudio at the church. Hop kick, cross that. Crystal low. ball is accurate. Get that down court out of here. Powers up, Starburst. Nice, good block. Wow, Ooh. he gets the right punish with the wall standing too. Now going the other way. Can we go downstairs, you think? Positioning has been lost. Ooh. Oh, why did you move that way? Get up on a duck. And starting what I've talked about, uh -oh. the opening rounds to Kokoma. Nice punish on the low. He is definitely, see, what you don't see is Claudio has a meter right now. It's the annoyance meter. Right now he's building it up. Breadman is powering up. He's getting What the? Up. Come on. He sights up to way on to the left side, but the down for two still caught him. Nice, goes for the slicer there. What's he gonna do, man? He is in a bad situation. It's like no almost help. I called He's it, 2-0. No Starting it off. Ray Shad mix up, keeps him in check with the jab, and then goes low, but still very behind. 2-0. Oh Kokuma. my gosh, Kokoma starting off 2-0. Who would have thought? But this is where it gets interesting. I have a feeling I've used the time stone. I saw 14 million possible futures. I don't know. I, I think you saw the wrong one, though. <laughs> Maybe, but you know, he Go has downstairs? a chance. Yes. 
spike. No, oh, he goes for the screw. He had another one available. But this is it going to be enough? Oh, here's the punch. He now has him in the corner. This is a good position. Yeah, but he's still very, very he's behind. Moving. He's, he's moving. He's behind. Nice. Just for the low out of range. Wonder Woman duck. No punish, but this is the last chance. That's oh, never it. mind. I was wrong. 3-0. Kokomo with the download and the pose. Look at him. He did the the Hulkamania pose. He did the, what, did, what is that, the Chris Jericho? 